फाइव सेकेंड्स टू गो स्टार्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल I am be holden to your foundation for having given me this opportunity to be with you here this day your annual lectures have already become extremely popular and useful i find that a long line of eminent personalities have been speaking to you on the foundation's annual day they have presented their points of view to you they have brought to bear their experiences on the issues of population and development going through some of their speeches i found that there is very little that has been unsaid or remains to be said on this particular subject hence i find myself rather in a very difficult position to propound anything new or worthwhile it is my handicap also that i do not belong to the profession of those who have been working very hard on this particular issue and therefore what i would speak to you today will not be anything new but i will try to minimize the torture of listening to me by trying to be as brief as possible because i think that it is the only way to earn your goodwill well friends for some of you who are present here you know that i belong to a particular school of thought in this country which formally believes that we have a great future ahead and i am bullish i would say on india but certainly there is one subject on which i feel cowed down and i do not feel strong enough to defend our records and that is the question of population i think some of us have been guilty of not giving the same prominence to this subject which it deserved note that there were no proponents of this particular thought or idea that population is a very important dimension of a country's growth problems note that there were no people who were telling us why we should give more importance to it but somehow most of us were so carried away by the ideas of sheer economic growth and development that we thought that this is a problem of number which could easily be solved but then when i look in retrospect and think of the days which were given to us to do something i feel that it was one of the ironies of life that we wanted to serve the people we forgot about the numbers we belong to a civilization a culture which celebrates marriages we have a fascinating concept of weddings and wedding ceremonies we spend lots of money on sweets and laddus when babies are born yet at the same time we discover what a horrifying figure the people become when the numbers become unmanageable and therefore we felt that perhaps the developmental side would remain gloomy and dark unless and until the population side is brightened up and looked into 
in a very different manner from where we have been looking at it in fact when you look at the prospects of india with 850 million people already in position and we are marching towards a mark called billion number people on this earth we find that perhaps we will not really be able to take care of the welfare of those great numbers that is where we feel that we are perhaps caught in a trap in the language of the economists it is the malthusian trap that is the power of earth to grow to produce what you call the needs of the people will be totally overtaken by the power of the people to expand in numbers about 200 years ago when the 18th century was coming to an end europe witnessed a similar situation hundreds and thousands of people were sleeping in absolute discomfort in the lanes and by lanes of london paris and other places there was a wave of unrest all over there were disturbing factors all over there was a tide which was running so high that people did not know and could not understand as to what its meaning was but one thing was clear that throughout europe there was uneasiness there were convulsions there were revolts to which they could not attribute one single cause to explain it in france of course they found some sort of an answer in the failure of its economy and the collapse of its finances but in the rest of europe they were becoming victims of swelling numbers of people in that they would not understand as to what was motivating these people to call and to question their status quo to shake the roots as one would say the institutions of europe then there came a discerning man by name malthus and he said that this is all happening because the power of the population has overtaken the power of the earth to produce the needs of the people he saw them coming into the streets of london he saw them sleeping on the naked earth without any support or without any cover store